Hey everyone! Today I'm gonna do a what's in my bag video um, because I love them and I hope you guys will enjoy watching mine as much as I enjoy watching everyone else's. No. Okay, well let's start with my bag. This is it. It's very big, I know. Um, it's from Marshalls, I believe. Yeah, it ha I'm sure it's from Marshalls. Um, and I got it at the end of the summer, but I thought it would be really good for fall um, and for school because I don't really like to carry a backpack. I'm kind of like a girly girl like that. Like I don't like carrying around this big floppy ugly backpack, especially because I usually only have like one or two classes at a time, so I don't need a lot of books with me. Most of my classes you don't need books for, like during the class you just need like a notebook. So, um, and... I got it. it was actually pretty affordable. Um, the brand is something I don't even remember. Oh well, I don't know. It's brandless, but um, I think it was maybe like thirty dollars, which I think is nice because it's it's a nice, you know, it's fake leather, but it's a nice bag. So um, inside my bag, we have lots of fun stuff. Okay, we'll just start with my planner. Um, I, if I'm taking this purse since it's big enough, I take this with me all the time. I love my planner. Um, it's from, it's like Daytimer. And I've just got like pictures and fun stuff. And then it goes like, it's like months. It's the, um, the Flavia, Flavia, I don't know how to say it. That's the, she's the one who, or whoever, Whatever that is, that's the designs that um, the actual pages of the planner are. You can get like the plain kind. But I like these ones because they're, see they have little, cute little things like that. So, that's my planner. I'm kind of anal about it. I write everything down and I put it in a planner on my computer. Um, I went to the dentist earlier today and um, the dental hygienist was telling me about this guy, um, Nicholas Schnell, <coughs> he's, uh, has all these fancy letters after his name, um, RD, LMNT, which is registered dietitian, and then LMNT is, um, licensed medical nutrition therapist, and then AHG, I'm not sure what that is, but he's also a clinical herbalist. Anyways, she was telling me about all of these really interesting things that he, um, he gave a sem seminar on, and, um, Interesting things like green tea is actually really good for your teeth. Not for your teeth, but like your gums. Sorry. Green tea is really good for your gums. Who would have... I wouldn't have known that. Um, and then sheet. Because I get canker sores often. Not, not a lot, but fairly often. Like maybe once a month. So she gave me this list of things that I think that he gave out of this seminar that help. They're really like natural and herbal, um, like aloe vera juice or a leaf, which I'm not sure where you get aloe vera juice. Licorice root, um, and I guess there's chewable tablets of that, and like um, sage leaf, chamomile, stuff like that. So I'm gonna give some of these a try, it's pretty helpful. And also, I love going to the dentist so much. Okay, let me just divert. <laughs> I'm the kind of person where if I know I have a dentist appointment a couple weeks before, I'll be really good about, like, flossing and all that stuff. I always brush my teeth, and you know, twice a day. Um, but I'm not very um, good about flossing. I know. I try, but it's hard to remember, I think. And it takes more time and yada yada. But I always try to be really good about it before I go. That way, like, they think, oh, you're doing really well. Because if you don't and you go and they floss your teeth, usually you bleed a lot. Your gums bleed. So... Um, so I go in there today and there's like chocolate chip cookies sitting on the counter. I'm like, you know, I spent all this time making my teeth look nice for you guys. I'm not about to eat a chocolate chip cookie before I go into the dentist to have you clean my teeth. You're going to be like, what are all these crumbs doing in your teeth? Huh? What is that about? And they're, they're sugary and that's not good for your teeth. What is that? That's like, come on. <laughs> maybe, maybe I'm just, I don't know. Maybe I'm the only one who would ever make that connection, but either way. I was amused by that. 
But um, I love the dentist so much. I know I already said that, but I'm repeating it. And I got a new toothbrush. Let's see what color. Oh, it's pink. <laughs> There's this joke in my family. Um, my sister loved pink when she was little. And so anything that she saw that was pink, she would go, it's pink, and get like really excited. So that's kind of a joke. And then little toothpaste. I love these little goodie bags. They're so cute. Okay. And we have my sunglasses case. It's from Fossil. So are my sunglasses. Look like this. You guys saw them in my other video. Um, keys. Nothing too special. Mailbox key. My parents' house key. Um, my key to my apartment. The key fob to get in and out of the doors in the garage. Car key. Car opener. All these little reward thingies, PetSmart, Borders, Dick Blick, CVS, Baker's, Sally Beauty Supply, um, it's breast cancer awareness, uh, or just breast cancer ribbon um, thingy, because I have lots of friends and family that have had or have breast cancer, so I like to support it. Um, and then this little keychain is from my dad. <laughs> he got it for me when I turned 16 and you know got my license and everything he was all worried about me driving and being safe on the road he's like okay now you put this on your keychain and every time you drive you think about me and you be safe so I love it I think it's really cute so I've had that for a while um got my camera and the camera case obviously both pink I'm not like obsessed with pink or anything it just kind of happened that way <sighs> oh my gosh my wallet's pink too <laughs> I have so many wallets. I like I switch my wallets all the time. But this is my wallet right now. It's really old. I probably have had it since I was in ninth grade. It's fossil also. So that's why I've had it so long. It's it's a good wallet. It's lasted me. Um, got like ID and school card, school ID, credit cards, random coupons, and other things. Yeah, that's it's a pretty typical wallet. Um, water bottle. Gotta stay hydrated. I'm all about drinking the water. Got my phone. Never, ever, really, ever do I leave the house without this. <laughs> um, got my iPod. It's an old school iPod. Very old school. Come on. Um, gum. Usually never leave the house without this either. I'm kind of obsessed with gum. <clears throat> um, this little thing. I keep a bunch of fun stuff in it. Um, I don't really want to go through the whole thing because that would be kind of boring and like who really cares. There's like, I keep like lotion, like a mirror, little mirror, um, ibuprofen, <laughs> Neosporin, nail clippers, nail file, um, extra like lip gloss or chapstick. It's just like a little, emer not emergency quite, but like kind of like just a little thing I carry everywhere that has all the like the little stuff that I don't want floating around my purse. And then I just, in the zipper pocket, I keep chapstick, which I also never leave the house without. Um, right now, this lipstick and lip gloss. And I used to have a pencil in here, but now I just have a pen, apparently. A pen. And that's about it. That's what's in my bag. I hope you guys enjoyed, and hope you have a fabulous day. Bye.